This is MSJ Chem. In this video, I'll be looking at the chemistry of Kevlar. Kevlar is a polyamide formed from benzene 14 diamine and benzene 14 dicarboxylic acid. So here we can see the full structural formulas of the two monomers, so that's benzene 14 diamine and benzene 14 dicarboxylic acid. In the reaction, a hydrogen atom from one of the amine groups reacts with an OH group on the dicarboxylic acid. This forms a molecule of water and a covalent bond between the carbon and nitrogen atoms. This bond is known as an amide link. And here we can see one repeating unit of the polymer chain. Kevlar can also be produced from benzene 14 diamine and benzene 14 dicarbonyl dichloride. So on the right we have the full structural formula of benzene 14 dicarbonyl dichloride. In the reaction, a hydrogen atom in the diamine reacts with a chlorine atom in benzene 14 dicarbonyl dichloride. This forms a molecule of hydrogen chloride and a covalent bond between the carbon and nitrogen atoms, which is known as an amide link. The strength of Kevlar is mainly due to the hydrogen bonding that occurs between the polymer chains. So here we can see the hydrogen bonding that occurs between the oxygen atom and the hydrogen atom. This hydrogen bonding, together with the highly ordered structure of the polymer chains, give Kevlar its strength. Kevlar is soluble in concentrated sulfuric acid. This is because the oxygen and nitrogen atoms are protonated, which breaks the hydrogen bonds between the polymer chains. The second reason is that the amide link is hydrolyzed by strong acids. So when a polyamide such as Kevlar reacts with a strong acid, we get the formation of a carboxylic acid and an alkyl ammonium ion. This reaction breaks the amide links in the polymer chain.